Army of One, his B-movie action revenge movie making done well. Get your full fix of fist and feet kicking fury right here as 1000 Maniacs meets Deliverance. Opening with two detectives hunting down a gang of knife wielding psycho masked killers who get their rocks off. Home invading families and brutally killing them. One of the police detectives, played by Matt Passmore, gets stabbed. Surviving the attack, he takes leave of duty to rest and recuperate from his injury. Dillian and his wife, Bremner, pack up their camper van and hit the back roads to escape from civilization. They stop off near their final destination in the wilderness, a small town community where the locals are not so welcoming of strangers. It's not too long thereafter that Dillian and Brenner's quiet break from society and people turns bad. As no matter where you go, people are never truly very far away. When the couple come upon a small stopover homestead to rest up in, they unwittingly discover a stash room of weapons and the town thug Butch, along with his backwards goons, catch them on the property that they have a holding in. When they discover Dillian is a cop, Butch coldly takes matters into his own hands and shoots the couple in cold blood. Dillian is killed outright and Brenner is believed dead also and the two lifeless bodies are dispensed of in a shallow grave in the woods. Brenner comes to from her headshot that actually only grazed her temple. Not only has Butch and his boys taken her death as a given but discovering her husband to be a cop turns out not to be the biggest threat to them. As Brenner is so much more than a cop's wife. She is a military trained ranger, professionally honed to survive and fight. They killed the man she loved and she won't rest until they pay with their very lives in Army of One. Ellen Holman plays the role of vengeance-seeking female Ranger Brenner and she is perfectly cast here. Naturally attractive young woman and well honed with real life athletic and highly trained in the art of jiu-jitsu. She's a rising star and one to look out for in the future of mainstream film. Having showcased her evident skills and highly capable consumer acting abilities in top TV shows that include Spartacus, Hawaii Five-0, NCIS New Orleans, Lethal Weapon and Into the Bandlands. Next up for Ellen is a role alongside Keanu Reeves in The Matrix 4. Here she is quite evidently an army of one. She puts grieving of her dead husband on hold to dust herself down, grab an axe, sharpen a solid stick to a weaponized point and then goes to town. Ranger Brenner hunts down Butch and his gang with bloody intent which leads her to the big mama head of the family and a racketeering and abduction holding of young girls for corrupt personal gain. She becomes a one woman takedown team and G.I. Jane Rambo style cleans house and takes out the trash. Ellen, she exterminator, Holman, if you're not dying, she'll be back. This is the characterization of a military trained ranger delivering credible hand to hand combat technique and a cool combo of both take it and dish it back out panache to revel in and get behind director Stephen Durham's 
neat little hard action piece outing here. This is one resilient ranger and the movie delivers a well paced 6 out of 10 top lower budgeted production. Stick around for sure for the three month later epilogue post movie climax impact for a smile to the face delivery of justice and a taste of what more may come from this army of one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.